afternoon, Scorpions. I'm Brandi Williams, and welcome back to another episode of Scorpion News Live. Hey, Scorpions, did you know, since the Earth's been around, it has gone through five mass extinctions? That means the Earth has been almost wiped out of all living organisms five times. And with that being said, Earth Day is April 22nd. So make sure to show your appreciation by polluting a little less and recycling something. Today is April 17th, and that means Grease is the word. The drama department is having their annual musical production. This year's play is Grease. Shows start at 7 p.m. tonight through the 19th at Oak Hills. There will also be a 2 p.m. showing on the 19th, so come out and support Scorpions. Heads up! Fourth quarter progress reports come out April 25th, so get those grades up now. And seniors, the day after, on April 26th, is your prom. The theme is a night in London, so have fun. Well, let's turn it over to our live sports with Karina Sandoval and then a public service announcement. Hello Scorpions, I am Karina Macias and I'm here with your live sports update. I want to give a shout out to baseball for, for both JV and varsity on that win against Apple Valley. Good luck to JV baseball guys tomorrow at Sultana. And also, come support the girls as well here at home at 315 against Sultana. Also, boys tennis on that good effort on the last game against Toronto. And good luck tomorrow as well. Golf, good job boys yesterday on beating Rim of the World. And shout out to Sean Lynch for his score of 37. Track and field, I just want to say good job on how hard you guys have been working out there on the field. Good luck today against Toronto, and go get them, guys. Now, let's take a look at Sports Chat with Jessica. Hello, student body. Coach Villalobos from track and field. I want to send a shout out to all the medalists at the Monrovia Invitational that placed, and also at the Apple Valley Fresh Off Meet. I want to say uh, good job to all my golfers out there uh, this year. Uh, we have one, Sean Lynch, that uh, is looking to make it to CIF. He's top five in the league right now, so uh, uh, good job, guys. Keep up the good work. This is a great day for tennis out here. Uh, I'd like to invite everybody to go out for the tennis team. It's a lot of fun. This is Coach Brookshire, uh, Sperry Softball. Uh, big win yesterday over Serrano. Uh, it was close. We pulled it out. That keeps us in the playoff hunt. If we uh, play like we keep playing, we'll be in the playoffs and hopefully get uh, a little farther than last year. Let's go, Scorpions! Scorpions. Thank you, Jessica, for that chat. Before I take you back to Brandy, I just want to say congratulations to Alexandra Spears for getting Athlete of the Month. She is my best friend, and I know how hard she has been working to get to where she is. I am so proud of her, and she has well earned this. Also, congratulations to the other Athlete of the Month, Sean Lynch, for the excellent work he has been doing lately to get to where he is now. Well, that is it for today's sports update. Until next time, have a good day, Scorpions, and remember, stay active. Back to you, Brandy. In a recent study, 75% of people have admitted to littering. Over half of litter in this country is food related. Items like wrappers, paper trays, and plastic spoons are found in our cities, including our schools. Meow. Take some pride, Scorpions. Keep our school clean. Thank you, Karina, for those live sports and great job, Scorpion athletes. Keep up the good work. And remember, have a heart and do your part by keeping the earth clean. Staff Appreciation Week will be May 5th through the 9th, so show a little love to your teachers and staff, Scorpions. Now here's Karina Sandoval again with the ASL and, Jer and Jericho Velasco bringing you your Scorpion highlights.
What up, Scorpions? I am Karina Macias, and I'm here with your ASL segment. Today, I'm going to teach you how to say please and recycle. Let's begin. This is how you sign please. Now you try it. Please. One last time. Please. Now, this is how you sign recycle. One more time. Recycle. Last time. Recycle. Now, put both of them together. Please recycle. That is it for this ASL segment. Remember, Earth Day is coming up, so please recycle. Thank you, Karina, and I'll make sure to tell people to please recycle. This is go back to the drama. People. For people needing to retake the CASI, the ELA portion will be May 12th, and the math portion will be May 15th. Good luck. Hey, congratulations, sophomores, on your victory at the Rough and Tough. Well, let's take it over to Jericho Velasco's for that drama highlight. We're here with Brianna Early, a member of the Drama Club. So, Brianna, what is the Drama Club? The Drama Club is a group of us who enjoy acting, and we all get together to make performances. What activities are the Drama Club involved in? Well, twice a year we put on different plays, and then twice a year we also compete in different competitions called Festival. Okay, Festival. It's this humongous competition with a bunch of niños and niñas. There's a bunch of kids there, a, a whole bunch. It goes from, it's from sixth grade to 12th grade, I think it is. And it's a big competition. There's a bunch of judges there. And we, um, we, we bring a scene there and we just compete. It's, it's, it's a lot of fun. And we're, it feels good to be one of the best schools out there. <laughs> what can I say? Miss Perry High School, we gotta represent. What's the next play for the drama department? Um, Grease, you know, with John Travolta and people like that. I don't know the girl's name, whatever. And what are the date and times for this play? Um, April 17th through 19th. It's 7 o'clock um, all three days, but there's also another showing on Saturday, which is um, at 2. Thank you. Good job, Jericho, on that amazing drama highlight. Seniors, remember your grad assembly is May 8th during third period and May 15th during fifth period. Don't forget. Also, don't forget to show your support to your fellow track team at their home meet today after school and to drama at Oak Hills tonight. Last but not least, a big shout out to Marisol Morales who competed and showed her scorpion spirit and Miss Teen pageant at El Monte High School. We're proud of you. Well, that's all for Scorpion News Live. Have a great day, and remember to please recycle. Thank you. 